Okay, good morning everyone. Welcome to GRSC 6042, Intermediate Quantitative Research Methods. My name is Professor John Baconshone. If you look in Moodle for this course and you look under Participants, you should be able to find my picture and my email address. So if you have any questions, you're welcome to email me. So hopefully you will have already received an email from me uh, via Moodle that will have given so you know that you are correctly enrolled for this course and hopefully you've already will have been and logged into Moodle in order to see what is going on. Now let me just check. Yes indeed the recording is working properly. Let me just pause it for one moment. Okay, so if you log into Moodle and look at the course, you will see that there are four assignments highlighted on the screen. And for you, you will be able to see the deadlines for each of these weekly assignments, assignment one, two, three, four. And if you click on the link, you'll be able to see the PDF file that will tell you the full details of those four assignments. In addition, I've put another four um, pseudo assignments, I guess, in here. I've asked you after watching each of the videos, so the week one videos, week two, week three, and week four videos, to come and make a brief submission here online or on file, confirming that you have the materials, that you have watched the videos, and listing any questions that you have after watching the videos. Now, the course book, and the videos you can find in the courseware folder in Google Drive. Presumably you've already found it there in order to be able to watch this video. You can download the course book here, uh, but you can also get the videos either from here or from YouTube. I have set up a private channel in YouTube and I will send you the link uh, via Moodle to that YouTube channel so you can watch the videos in YouTube. If you watch them in YouTube, obviously you can also have the subtitles. So I am setting up subtitles. So in case you can't quite follow everything I've said, you'll be able to at least read the, the subtitles. Now, when I looked at the videos I had done previously for this course, I wasn't happy with the audio quality. Unfortunately, the mic had not been working properly. So I have redone all the videos for this course. So instead of setting them up on the usual uh, weekly basis, which is how I've done it in the past, I've instead divided up the videos by the chapter in the course book. So that's why the videos are set up in this way. So for example, for the first week, other than this introduction video, there will be two other videos, one on the relationships between pairs of variables uh, and another one about the first assignment. Now, some of these videos are quite long. I have not split them into parts, but of course you can pause them at any point if you want to take a break. Obviously, uh, listening to me in a video for more than an hour is, is very hard to, to concentrate. So you can, you can divide up your watching of the video as you wish. But I've set it up that you will need to have watched the complete video or read the course book for that chapter fairly thoroughly in order to do the assignment. Uh, and even if you choose to read the course book, I still encourage you at least to watch carefully the video about the assignment where I explain in some more detail what the expectations are and I give you some guidance as to the things to look out for in doing the assignment. Okay, so if you have any questions you're welcome to email me at johnbs at hku.hk. I will also give you my mobile phone number so that you can use WeChat or WhatsApp if you need to contact me if you have any questions. I realize that having the course online only is not ideal, but in a situation where you may be anywhere in the world, this is our attempt to do the best we can under the circumstances. So if there's anything that's unclear or if there's any problems with you accessing the videos, 
please let me do and I, let me know and I will do my best to try and uh, solve any problems you have. Okay, thank you very much.